My name is Mohammed King. I am a senior at Wayne State University and I study mathematics. I chose to study mathematics for the challenge. Um, growing up, I, I don't think I was the smartest kid in my class in mathematics. Um, but when I got to Wayne State University, and especially getting involved with the math core, it was like a family. One cool thing about mathematics is if something is true, um, if, if you say something is true, you have to prove it. When you get that proof, um, when you actually champion that problem, it's like the greatest feeling in the world. I had an excellent instructor named Mr. Bohm. I actually co-teach uh, co a class at a local uh, middle school with Mr. Bohm now uh, in the mornings. It's funny how that worked out. Uh, but he was incredible and he would, he, he, I wasn't the best student in calculus too, I don't think, coming in. Um, but he made me a really good student because he just really, really cared. He really, really believed in us and our abilities. And he made it so cool. He would crack jokes and everything and he made it so much fun and I never had a teacher like that before. Before I came, uh, before I came to Wayne State. There were so many people here in the math department that were helpful and really made me realize my love for mathematics here. I saw a bunch of papers on my professor's door that he had written in research, and I didn't understand any of them. <laughs> they were all way over my head. But I walked into his office one day, uh, during his office hours, I walked into his office one day and I said, hey, you know, I saw these math papers on, on your door. How does one get, get involved in math research? How does that happen? How does one come across? I was just curious. He started telling me about it, but during the conversation, he saw that I really wanted to do this kind of stuff. So he got me set up with a research problem. He actually sent me a file that night um, with a research problem laid out. It was important for me for a lot of reasons. For one, it, it told me that I had so much to learn. Um, that's part of the reason why math has been so powerful for me, because no matter how many courses I go through, no matter how much I study it, no matter how much I feel like my, my brain is developing, I, I still have so much to learn, and I look up to these guys that, that know so much. I just want to learn as much as they can, as much as I can. My research is about classifying geometric spaces of high dimension. Being a student in the mathematics program here, there were a, a million just just helpful pro professors who provided that mentorship for me, and that knew so knew so much more than me, but were still so helpful and patient and really were after not just me learning the mathematics, but me believing in my mathematical ability, and they would spend so much time with that. And Mr. Bohm, who was my Calculus II teacher here, who made me fall in love with mathematics, trained me in teaching that stuff during the summer at the math core. Even if kids aren't mathematically inclined, even if math isn't their favorite subject or something, it's my job to communicate to them that that mathematical thinking is so important and, and, and really it's about kids believing in themselves at that point, believing in their abilities. And it goes far beyond mathematics at that point.